Hi everybody, it's Friday, that means it's weigh-in day, so here's my weekly update. Um, this week I actually decided that I was not going to be on plan, I was taking a week off after all um, to kind of reboot everything as it were, to really kind of just draw a line under everything and then start fresh and try and get back a bit of the excitement of being on the plans. I've been doing the plan for quite a while now, it's over a year and you know that feeling when you've been doing something for ages and you lose sight of what you're doing and, and what you want to do. I thought I'm just going to take the week off because I was going out for a meal and uh, going out for a night out and I just thought you know I'm just gonna forget about it this week and just take a hit on the chin whatever it is and then start fresh. Um, which was kind of liberating in a way, um, but I seem to have done better than I thought. I must have still unconsciously been focusing on food optimising because I had a surprise maintain, um, which has kind of given me a boost, to be honest, and has made me more determined to go back to my book and start from scratch and really read through the book like I did in the beginning and get excited about it again. I think getting a maintain is probably the best thing that could have happened because I mean, I'm not on a downer from a gain and I'm not on a complacent kind of run from losing. So I'm, I'm ready to hit the ground running as it were. Um, largely, I think I credit my hair loss for my maintain actually. Um, I weighed my hair when it was taken off and it was actually 13 ounces so the best part of a pound <laughs> came off my head which is quite good a little bit extra probably about a pound of hair came off my head because I just weighed the stuff that had been cut rather than the stuff that had been shaved so uh, it weighed more than I thought um look at this my mum gave me this present she gave me this really cool ear cuff I'm wearing earrings for the first time in years I don't think I've worn earrings since my eldest was either a baby or even before he was born and he's going to be eight in September. So um, I'm with my ears being on show now, I thought I'd you know, stick some earrings in. I took a bit of poking through but I got there in the end. Um, big thank you to everyone who has um, sponsored me for the, the big shave as it were. Um, my target was £365, a pound for every day that I was growing my hair. And I've smashed that. Um, I'm sitting currently on just over 500. And there are several people who have also pledged to give this week when they see me. So um, I'm hoping it'll be up closer to 600, certainly around the 550 mark. I'm really chuffed with that. Thank you so much, everybody. I really appreciate it. It's um, really, <laughs> it's really been heartening to see how many people care about helping a cause like Macmillan uh, Cancer Support who really do help not just the people who have cancer but their families in dealing with it and it's it's a really good cause and of course my lovely long locks are now all off going to uh, give some kids that have lost their hair through chemo uh, a new wig it's really fun this is actually already I can already see that it's growing through already just since Monday and it'll be interesting to see how quickly it grows and I can't see myself leaving it like this permanently or even going this short ever again, but I do actually kind of like it. Um, and it feels like velvet. It's <laughs> My kids keep stroking my hair like I'm a puppy. <laughs> it's funny. And a lot of people keep saying, oh, what does it feel like? Can I touch it? I'm like, yeah, on you go, have a stroke. It's really quite... It's, it's odd being able to see my scalp. See all the white. Oh, my God. I didn't realize how much, how much white I had in my hair. almost looks bald at that because of it. But... Um, yeah, I kind of like it. <laughs> it's very liberating and I get ready in no time in the mornings now. Just put on my face and off I go. <laughs> it feels really odd when it's raining though, because the rain just kind of fall, 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 dip, 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 I can really feel it. And then <laughs> straight into my face because there's nothing to stop it. So it's quite weird having rain all down my face. But yeah, it's, it's good. But anyway, this week I, um, I've already started planning. I have a menu plan for the week. So I'm going to have all kinds of yummy foods, curry and falafel and uh, all kinds of just lovely delicious meals that are going to be healthy and filling and loads of speed food. Uh, it's going to be really great. Um, I don't have any nights out or anything planned. I am, well, I am 
we are taking the kids to the circus on Saturday afternoon, tomorrow afternoon. But um, I don't need to eat circus food. I don't need, I don't like hot dogs or, or burgers from burger vans or anything like that very much. So I hate hot dogs, yuck. But <laughs> popcorn and things are quite tempting, but I'm, I'm just not going to bother with that. Although candy floss is only three and a half sins for a stick. How awesome is that? It's just basically a pile of sugar, but it's only three and a half sins. So I might treat myself to some candy floss. I haven't had that since I was a kid. Um, <clears throat> so it's going to be a good week and I am determined. I'm feeling almost invigorated again about the plan. I'm feeling a lot more confident in myself and I feel I can... I can do this. I'm really kind of feeling that kind of gung ho ness about it again. It's really, it's going to be a good week. I don't care what happens. I'm going to be on plan and I'll be interested to see how much I can lose next week because I, I do feel it's going to be a loss, a good loss. And uh, so we'll, we'll see how it goes next week. Uh, have a great week, everybody. Uh, if anyone would like to still sponsor me, for, for this, for Macmillan, the um, Brave the Shave page will stay open indefinitely, so I'll leave the link below. It's really great. Thank you to, again to everyone that's already done that. Um, yeah, have a great week, um, and I hope everyone has a great loss this week. Be losers. Be big losers. <laughs> I'll see you later. Bye.